like, share, subscribe. Hey y'all, welcome back. Number 39 here with a word problem. A colony of bacteria starts with two bacteria at noon. Uh, if the colony of the bacteria triples every 30 minutes, how many bacteria will be present at 3 p.m. on the same day? Uh, so you really could use a, an exponential equation to, to model this, where you say y equals, start with two. Um, you know, the general form of an exponential equation is gonna look like this, where a is your initial amount and b is your multiplier here. So you could write one that says, okay, we start with two, we're gonna triple every 30 minutes, figure out, well, how many increments of 30 minutes are there between noon and 3 p.m.? So that's three hours, right? And so since every hour is 60 minutes, that's gonna be a total, we did start at noon, right? Yeah, noon to 3 p.m. So three hours, that's gonna be a total of six triplings. Um, this is gonna be, uh, how you this is this, this is one way how you can get your answer. Um, let me just type that in. So two times three to the power of six. Just typing this in the old scientific calculator here. We get one thousand four hundred fifty-eight. We get our answer. Um, but if you're not sure how to write this as an exponential equation, you could alternatively just make a table. You know, just kind of keep track of how many bacteria there are at uh, these thirty-minute increments. So if this is the time, uh, if, if my left column is the time and my right column is the number of bacteria, I can just kind of approach it like this and say, all right, well at noon, which is 12 o'clock, right, noon, uh, we've got two. And so at 12.30, um, it tripled, right? So two times three would be six. Not sure why we uh, switched to black there all of a sudden. There we go. And then, um, so 30 minutes later would be 1 o'clock. Again, what's going on with the font switching here? I don't know. Okay, we'll just go to black. Okay, so we're going to triple again. 6 times 3 is 18. Um, eventually, we'll get to a point where we want to type it in the calculator. At 130, multiply that by 3. I think it's about time we do that. 18 times 3. It's going to be 54. So at 2 o'clock, we can multiply that by 3 again. Get 162. At 2.30, we are going to multiply that by 3, and we get 486. And then the last tripling would be at 3 o'clock. This is what we're really interested in here. If we multiply that by 3, I get 1,458. So I get the same answer either way. If you're not sure how to set up the exponential equation, it doesn't take very long to set up a little table and just kind of keep track of the amount of bacteria. Um, but if you're, if, if you're decent with the exponential equations, it is faster to do it that way. So whichever way you decide to do it, we're going to pick C here as our answer. And that's it for number 39. Thanks for watching and uh, have a great day.